you come down a hit, got a hill here, it's a little bit slick, a little bit hard, got a bowl turn here. So you want to come on the outside to use the whole turn. Once you get in the turn, look ahead where you're going to the jump. I'll do it again. Here we have a long straightaway coming into a bowl turn here. So you want to start on a bowl turn, you want to start where the bowl starts and end where the bowl ends. Then you keep your momentum. So you come in here, right when you get your front end here, you stick your foot out, look ahead, and out you come out of the corner. All right, here we have a bowl turn. This bowl turn is pretty blue grooved and hard. So the power delivery is the same as a flat corner. You don't want to get uh, too aggressive with it. You want to be in the right gear. You can be a little bit more aggressive because you have a bank. In a bowl turn, if it's not rutted and it's a nice smooth one, you want to enter it where it starts. You want to exit it where it ends. Then you can keep your momentum up. Then you can be on the gas a lot sooner. If you come in, in the middle, skid it, and turn, you're losing momentum. You're stopping and then going. And to me, the fastest way around it is using the whole bowl, kind of like a uh, kind of like a NASCAR. They don't come in, skid, and turn. They go around and use the whole thing. Um, right when your front wheel enters, you want to be able to look, turn your head and look where you're going. It goes where your eyes go. If you look straight down, you're not going to be able to get on the gas as soon, and you're not going to be able to tell what's coming up as quick. So for me, when you get in there, look ahead, and you'll go where your eyes go, and you'll be out of the corner before you know it.